Hello everybody, good morning. Hello health warriors, welcome to my channel, Totally Transformed. Today guys, I'm gonna go over with you why it is I'm drinking this drink here. This, it keeps leaking all over me. <laughs> but uh, typically it doesn't. Maybe I don't have this on enough. All right, anyway. Um, yeah, so this is a colon intestinal cleanse that actually gets rid of mucosal plaque or the intestinal sludge that builds up in your intestines basically and the reason i wanted to try this guys is I've, I've actually been wanting to do this for a really long time just over time things can build up in your system and many people are on the sad diet i in particular haven't been for quite some time but I don't eat perfect and haven't, you know? So um, the intestinal sludge that builds up, it's, you know, very similar. You can kind of look at it as like a sink, like my bathroom sink's been clogged lately and I had to put some Drano in there and it didn't work. So it needs to either be cleaned out with a snake or my husband's gonna have to unhook it and do something. But this is not Drano. This would be attributed to more like a snake for your intestines, okay? Um, and it takes about two weeks for it to work, uh, for you to see the actual sludge, but it works right away from what I can tell. I have been getting a lot of detox off of this. You're gonna go to the bathroom a lot. It's got a ton of fiber. People that wouldn't be qualified to do this are those that are severely constipated and you need to work on that first, or if you react a lot to fiber, um, you would need to work on the constipation first before being able to do this, basically. Um, those, some people that are constipated react a lot with fiber, basically. So, uh, I wanted to go over what is in this, but first I wanted to address something too with you. You're probably wondering why on this channel I'm always talking about detoxification. The reason is, guys, in case you haven't understood at this time, it is one of the number one reasons in my philosophy that it, it helps the body heal. If I believe everyone should be doing some sort of detoxification on a regular basis at least twice a year and facilitate all throughout the year because we are exposed just to so many of them right now. I also uh, personally know um, that this is the key to healing from chronic illness is to get the funk out of the system. So uh, I wanted to address that first. Um, but so what is in this concoction? You're probably guessing why it's black. There is charcoal in here, chia seeds, psyllium husk fiber, bentonite clay, and lemon. And about it's, it requires two and a half cups of water, but this is almost 32 ounces. So it's a bit more than that. And um, let me just say, address this first. If you are looking to get kits that actually do this type of cleanse, I used to see them, this is probably why I haven't done this because, and I could have gotten a discount since I'm a practitioner of Chinese medicine, I get discounts on supplements, but they range anywhere from 150 to $200 is what I've seen. This will cost you probably between $50 to $60, which for some of you might seem quite expensive, but maybe some of you already have a lot of the stuff already. I had all the ingredients except for the bentonite clay. The bentonite clay was about $22. It'll cost you about $10 for the charcoal pills and maybe $15 for the psyllium husks and I don't know how much for lemons. I have a lemon tree, so I freeze my lemons. Um, and then the chia seeds about ten dollars a bag depending you can go to costco to get this chia seed i know that so that might save you a bit more money but i had a lot of this stuff to begin with so it really wasn't that expensive the bentonite clay was the most and the liquid form is what you want best so what do each of these things do first and foremost the um lemon actually shakes up the things on your intestines and it's a good cleanse in general to do because lemon actually is a great liver cleanse and it also helps to alkalinize the body. Um, <clears throat> but that's why you do the lemon in here. And you only required a teaspoon, but I put a cube in, which I'll show you how I make this right after I go through this. 
and then uh, both the charcoal and the bentonite clay absorb toxins within the system. You want to do this within an hour outside of eating and taking supplements. So um, you want to do this first thing in the morning, first thing at, or an hour after dinner is what I do at night because I have to take some supplements before I go to bed. So there you go for that one. And then, uh, so the bentonite clay, yeah, and the charcoal, they absorb toxins. And then the both the chia seeds and the psyllium husk, both of these fibers gelatinize. This is probably the hardest part about drinking it because it kind of tastes like lemon, lemon psyllium husk and the, and the it's the, not the chia seeds, it's the psyllium husk. It's hard to get down. I usually typically have to add more water to it to get it down and I've gagged a few times <laughs> trying to get it down. It's a texture thing. But um, this helps to uh, clear off the sides. It scrubs your walls of your intestines to clear it off. And this is why you need so much of each now what i have been doing because it's been too much is just doing an overflowing teaspoon of the psyllium husk instead of the two tablespoons which is it's almost two tablespoons to begin with but i haven't been able to increase it because it just was so much the first time i did it so and uh yeah it is it works really well i i have noticed uh, a big difference in the consistency and the amount that I go and yeah not to get into really great detail about that but uh, you'll notice a difference right away the other thing too is that it suggested that you will if you can eat better while you're doing this but you don't have to I'm not perfect this month it's my birthday month so I haven't been eating the, the most perfect every single day, but I'm still getting a release about it. But you're gonna get, for, especially for the intestinal sludge, you're gonna get more out of it if you eat well. And for me, it's just been a few meals here and there. So I'm gonna be right on track with this. I'm gonna be continuing to do this. You need to do it for at least, like I said, two weeks to see results from that. And what it could look like is part of your intestines coming out. Don't despair. <laughs> you'll see a lot of stuff come out. So it, it works really good. I really, really like it. So I hope you guys enjoy it. Now here's the recipe. Okay guys, here is how this whole thing comes together. In this, I have a 32 ounce jar full of water and then I have a lemon ice cube in here because I freeze my lemons. But it's really required one tablespoon of lemon. The next step is I'll put in one tablespoon of chia seeds and, well, that's a little bit more than that. And I mix them up because you wanna get that going and get the gelatinous part of that going. Next thing I'm gonna do is add, this is bentonite clay, you wanna mix it up and add two tablespoons of this. I got this exact brand on Amazon and the cost for that was about $22. So that was like the most amount of money that it costs for everything. Now I add this last because this gelatinizes and it just, uh, it's the hardest thing for me to get down. Two capsules of charcoal, but if you have it in powdered form, all you need is to have one tablespoon. This will get all over the place. It's always on my fingers. That's okay. Now, it requires two tablespoons of psyllium husks, but because I have a hard time with it, I just do one overflowing tablespoon. And then I just take it, I mix it up. Oops. a top on it and shake it up and there you go there is your detox drink mm. 
cheers bottoms up okay guys i hope you guys try this recipe it's really amazing i am putting my patience on this cleanse too to see how they do uh yeah i highly recommend it really good stuff um in fact for any type of cleanse i would start with this you know over even doing liver cleanse liver cleanse used to be the number one thing i would suggest but if your intestines aren't cleansing out it's not good and that intestinal sludge that builds up they say it builds up mostly in the small intestine where your nutrition is absorbed and so it's also preventing uh, you to get better if you have a, a, a chronic illness so this is really a good thing for any intestinal issues including leaky gut so all right guys i hope you try this if you have any more questions you can leave information below if you need any wellness coaching um, I do that from nationwide. Uh, you can inquire with that by going to lifeharmonywellness.com. And uh, also you can email us at lifeharmonycoach at gmail.com if you want to follow us on Instagram. Uh, it is at lifeharmonywellness. And uh, love and blessings, guys. I hope you have a great, great summer. Is it?